Joined now by head coach of the Kalamazoo Wings, Nick Bootland, after a 4-3 overtime victory over the Toledo Walleye. And coach, you came back from a 3-1 deficit. How big of a win was this? You know what, it was huge. I thought we played real well in the second and third periods. You know, we, we made one mistake in the uh, second period late with that face-off play. And we made a mistake that cost us a goal to, to give them the lead 2-1. And then um, what a shot they had to make it 3-1 um, by Kotze. And uh, uh, he buried that under the bar early on in the period, but we felt that if we played the way we played the second period, that we had a chance to get points out of this game. We stuck together, took advantage on the power play, uh, won the special teams battle tonight, and, and didn't let up. I mean, that's three games in three nights with some guys that are banged up, short-staffed on the back end, and, and, and found a way not to quit and get the victory tonight. Talk a little bit about those special teams. What was going right for the power play tonight? You know what? Uh, we moved Myron up to the power play with the, with the one unit, and uh, Clark on the back end because uh, Elgin Reed was out. And uh, they seem to click. You know, he's a, he, when he has open ice, uh, Myron makes um, some great plays. You know, he protects the puck well and uses his frame to do that. And, and a smart player, and obviously he took advantage. And then, you know, when you look at the nice pass by Lysak to Fatorik, and um, just able to contribute all around that, that power play. And then you look at the Sirota goal, shorthanded, um, huge for us. Two quick overtime goals last two nights. How can you explain that? Uh, Jan Sove, that's all I got to say. Uh, tomorrow, our next up Monday against Cincinnati. What are you looking for from the guys? You know what? This is a tough situation. This is one where you look at the schedule as a coach, and tomorrow has to be a day off. But to turn that engine back on and get that motor running again for a two o'clock game with no pregame skate because you can't because it's being at two is going to be a tough thing to do. So it's something we talked about, and we got to make sure that we're doing the right things. And these guys got to get up out of bed and get themselves a little sweat and uh, make sure that prepared. Do whatever you need to do as an individual to make sure you're ready to go. All right, thanks a lot, coach. Thank you.